Hi guys, here is how you can clone your voice using just few seconds of the audio. Please subscribe to our channel. So in order to clone your voice, we will be using this F5 TTS. This is a Python application and here are all the details on how you can install it. Like other projects, we will be using Anaconda to install this. So go to anaconda.com, click on free download, scroll down and click on download Miniconda installer. And in here, you can download the distribution installer. Click here for Windows and simply download and install this. The file size is nearly a ZB, so we have already downloaded and installed it. After installing Anaconda, go to the start menu and type Anaconda. You will find this Anaconda prompt. Simply open it. So here is it. Now let me go back to the GitHub page. Scroll down a bit. Here is how you can install it. Let's first create a Python environment 3.11. Let me copy this. And paste it here. So this will create a Python environment F5 TTS with 3.11 Python. Now press enter. Y and enter. So we have successfully created the Python environment F5 TTS. Now we need to activate this. Type conda activate F5 TTS and enter. You will see that the base name has changed to F5 TTS. Now let's install F5 TTS. By the way, this is the command we use to activate the environment. If you have NVIDIA graphics, run this command. If you have AMD GPU, run this one. For Intel GPU, run this. And this is for the Apple Silicon M1 M2 series. Now this PC does not have a GPU, so I will skip it. So I will run this command. Let me copy this and paste it here. Now this will install all the packages for F5 DTS. And this will take some time. So this is done. We also need to install FFmpeg. So type conda install FFmpeg. The compatible version for this is less than 8. Dash C conda dash forge. Basically, we are installing FFmpeg version less than 8. And enter. Y and enter. So this is also done. Now let's also install Dodge Codec. So type PIP install Dodge Codec and enter. So this is also done. Now go back to the GitHub page and download this. Go to code and download as zip. The file size is very small. So it's downloaded. Show in folder. Now open the zip file. I will close this all. And extract this to the desktop. So here is it. Now open this folder. And go to the src folder. And go to f5 underscore tts folder and copy this address copy address go back to anaconda type cd and paste it control plus v so you can see we are inside this folder actually it's the info folder so we need to be here copy the address again CD and paste it here. So we are now inside the info folder. Let me clear this up. After this, we need to open this info underscore radio python file. So type python info underscore radio dot py and enter. Please note 
During the first installation, it might also download some models which might be over a ZV in size, so it can take some time. Anyway, here is the URL, you can copy this and open any browser and paste it here. Or you can press Ctrl and click on it. So here is the interface. Now let's try to clone the voice. Let me simply upload the audio. Here is a sample audio. It is only 30 seconds of audio. Please use a clear audio of your voice. Let me play it and hear how it sounds. Hi guys. So we updated our iPhone to the latest iOS 26. And what's up with these icons? So this is my voice. You can also load the audio text, but we'll leave this. And on text to generate, type the text you want to convert to audio. So here is it. And on advanced settings, please experiment with this for better results. After this, simply click on synthesize. Since this PC does not have a CPU, it will take some time to clone the voice. So please be a little patient. To check if it is working or not, go to Anaconda prompt and you will see what is happening. It only uses small part of the audio. You can see this reference text from our voice and this is the text we want to convert to audio. Again, please note this will take quite some time to clone the voice. So please be a little patient. So this is done. Now let's hear how it sounds. Play it. Please subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much. So this is how it sounds. Not exactly as my vocals, maybe because of the accent. We did try with other native vocals and it worked great. So please do give it a try. And if you like this voice and settings, you can also use this seed number, so you will have the same voice. And to download, you can simply click here, and the audio will be downloaded. Now if you want to reopen the app after closing everything, it is very simple. Simply go to the start menu and open Anaconda prompt. Now activate the environment, Conda, activate, F5-TTS and enter. Make sure the base name had changed. After that, open the F5-TTS folder. Go to SRC, F5-TTS, to info folder. Copy the address and type CD space control plus V and run Python so we need to run this infer underscore gradient or py and you can press ctrl and click on the url and use the application hope this video was useful thank you very much